Yao Ming, who is best known as the former superstar professional basketball player for the Houston Rockets in the NBA, has managed to snag some pretty luxurious real estate, including a stunning mansion in Hunter's Creek Village of Houston. The home featured over 12,000 square feet of space and boasted six bedrooms and nine bathrooms, which he listed back in 2012, after Yao Ming moved back to Shanghai following his retirement from professional basketball in 2011. Casa de Yao came decked out with a number of luxe amenities, including a stunning grand entry, MVP style backyard and even a pink jacuzzi perfect for entertaining ladies and gentlemen this is a house tour that you do not want to miss in these videos we don't reveal any real addresses and even though we've done house tours of our own please do not show up at any private residences because it is not safe for anybody Yao Ming has had quite the lucrative career killing it in professional basketball garnering a net worth of 160 million dollars his highest career salary came in his final season when the Rockets paid Yao 17.6 million dollars in total he roughly earned about 93 million dollars in NBA salary alone. Yao earned and continues to earn significantly more money from brand endorsements and investments. While he was still playing, everybody wanted a piece of Yao. He even had Reebok, Visa, Garmin, McDonald's, and even Apple among his key sponsors. In 2010, Sports Illustrated Yao to be earning a whopping $34.37 million through endorsements on top of the $17.6 million he was already earning in salary. Yao Ming also has a number of personal investment endeavors, which include a restaurant in both Houston and Shanghai and a winery out in California. After retiring, Ming launched the NBA Yao Basketball Club in association with NBA China back in 2014, which provides training to young aspiring basketball players and took over his former team, the Shanghai Sharks. Ming is also the seventh biggest shareholder in a Shanghai exhibition company called A Blues Designs. In addition, Ming has invested with Baijiu in Houston, a private enterprise owned by a handful of American and Chinese investors. Furthermore, Ming has also invested $3 million yuan in a music website called Top 100. So it appears after killing it in professional basketball, Yao was building his own investment empire. I mean, Yao was a trailblazer for Chinese basketball, and he's widely considered to be the first major Chinese person to have a success successful career in the NBA. He helped increase the NBA's brand awareness in China by exponential leaps and bounds. In fact, on November 9th, 2007, over 200 million people in China tuned in to watch Yao play a game against the Milwaukee Bucks, which also featured a Chinese player named Yi Jilan. It was one of the most watched games in NBA history. What's going on guys? It's Clyde Smith, and today we are bringing you another house tour right here on Famous Entertainment. Now, I did notice about 95% of you watching aren't subscribed, so please be sure to hit that subscribe button because we post Post a new video daily. If you like these videos, ring that bell for notifications, follow me on the gram, and as per usual, let me know whose house tour is next in those comments down below. All right, let's get into this video. Located in the upscale suburban Hunters Creek Village community, Ming's Houston home featured nearly 12,000 square feet of living space, six bedrooms, and nine bathrooms, and was listed on the market for a tad under $4 million. The traditional style home was built in 1992 on a 3,000 square foot lot, so there was ample space. I mean, when you're seven foot six and 310 pounds, you're gonna need all the space you can get, and lucky enough for Ming, that's just what Casa de Yao had. Guests lucky enough to visit were greeted by a grand two-level foyer lined in marble that was nicely touched with a sleek spiraling staircase, custom cabinetry, and lustrous artwork. The foyer ceiling, just like a lot of other ceilings in this home, might be some of the highest ceilings we've ever had on house tours. To kick things off nicely, one of two wet bars and a wine room can be found just off the main entryway for those that fancy a nice glass of Chardonnay. I mean, geez, yeah, we just got here. Yao's formal dining room features a whopping three-story windows and magnificent chandelier and decked out with a profusion of custom fixtures and fittings. These windows put oversized ones to shame and allow for tons of natural light. Nicely topped with the Victorian tables and drawers, the dining room gives off a very sophisticated vibe. Yao's living room features a wealth of lavish furnishings, Victorian decor, plenty of windows giving the room bright light, and an airy and roomy ambiance, along with one of many cozy fireplaces. Yao's lavish abode featured a home office packed with custom wooden bookshelves and fixtures, brown leather sofas, and more oversized windows for good measure. We're willing to bet that Yao 
locked in an endorsement deal or two in there. Further along, the Abode features a wood-clad library that comes complete with a wet bar and fireplace. Bold moves sticking to the wet bar in a library, but I mean, hey, I'm digging it. When you're a big boy like Yao, you're gonna need a massive kitchen, and that's just what the home boasts. The kitchen features stainless steel appliances, marble countertops, and a beautiful island perfectly centered in the room. Take a look at the amount of space in the cupboards and in those cabinets. I mean, my goodness. In addition, the kitchen features a breakfast nook, dining area with access to the backyard, and a butler's pantry with more space than you know what to do with. One of the prime features of this home is the amount of windows and glass sliding doors that lead to outside, creating a unique in and out floor throughout. But more on the backyard in just a minute. Yao's master bedroom features a profusion of lavish furnishings, oversized windows, comfy fireplace, and an enormous flat screen television. In addition, the master bedroom features a walk-in closet, big enough to be another room in the house, and private balcony access overlooking the backyard. The master bathroom features dual sinks, a large whirlpool spa set in marble that boasts views of the ground, and a large standing shower, perfect for relaxation. Top of the staircase leads to a gracefully decorated landing, which connects to various upper level rooms, including an additional bedroom, complete with one bathroom. Now onto the goodies. Yao's Dig features a media room, which boasts an enormous projector screen and decked out with leather furnishings, perfect for binge watching live sporting events. Yao's game room featured both a billiards table and poker tables, with comfy seating, perfect for entertaining. Probably one of the most unique features in Yao's home was the massive pink jacuzzi. There is literally no way that Yao fits in this tub, and and what's with the movie theater style lighting? What's going on with that? We're willing to bet that when people came to party at Yao's, they probably wanted to soak in that thing. As glamorous as the interior of the home is, the backyard is truly the showstopper of this house tour. To start things off, Yao's backyard features a massive pool surrounded by an elegant stone terrace decked out with comfy outdoor patio furnishings. The pool also features a glamorous rock waterfall and an obligatory mini basketball hoop. I mean, of course, what I would have done to get an invite to that pool party, man, I tell you. Steps away from the pool, the backyard features features a number of luxe features, including an outdoor bar, barbecue, and kitchen. In addition, the backyard features an outdoor entertainment system and fire pit, perfect for hosting a number of people. You know, whether you're lying down and soaking in the sun, chilling in the pool, or even admiring Yao's manicured grounds and gardens, there is no shortage of luxury in this backyard. All right, so I think I'll bring this house tour to an end right here. We got to take a quick look at Yao Ming's former home in Houston. After seeing that fancy little abode he snagged, what did you think? Was it everything that you'd expect out of Yao Ming? I mean, personally, I'm a huge fan of that pink jacuzzi. Out of all of Yao Ming's features, which ones were your favorite? You can even go ahead and let me know in the comment section down below. My name is Clyde Smith, and I'll see you guys in the next video.